Next, the inner metal parts are not that uh, exciting. I used the same trick with the gradient here because I wanted them to be just a bit darker uh, towards the top, but you don't really see it that much. Although it has a subtle effect in the final render. Uh, the same here, again, uh, a simple anisotropic, actually anisotropy was set to zero here, so it's pretty much a glossy material. So again, our basic uh, metal network. And then of course we have the filament, which uh, will be a simple emission with a strength of 1000. You can uh, tweak this as you like. The remaining parts, the bulb and the inner bulb, and the inner piece are simple, uh, simple glass. Uh, defaults will be enough. And then also, every time you have something reflective, you want to have an environment texture. So I downloaded an environment texture from uh, SIBL. Uh, you'll find the link in the description. They have some pretty uh, nice uh, environment textures you can use. Once you have the environment, uh, a baked uh, the texture set you can uh, fire up the render and uh, we'll see how the compositing works